Hi, so this is Brad and Josh, and we're looking at a commercial property at the moment. As you can see, it's pretty overgrown now. It's uh, assessed at 300000 and uh, the opening bid's $13,000. Looks like it's on about, I don't know, a few acres, and it's confirmed the acreage, but it looks like there's a lot of acreage here, and there's a few outbuildings as well. So uh, we'll check out the area and see if it's a good rental or if it's a good flip. Good old Brad's just having a look there at the roof. So one of the interesting things about tax sales, when you're looking at the information on the county website, it says that this is uh, valued at $200,000. And then when you look at the photo on the county's website, it just shows a photo of this building right here, just the one. You know what's interesting though is that the square footage is uh, close to 4,000 and so that is not a 4,000 square foot unit which then begs me to ask what's going on now when you look at the parcel map though you can physically see where the lines are and there's actually multiple properties here in fact here's the second one interesting and there's a third. So there's three, there's three units here. So always make sure that you check the parcel map because that's gonna confirm what is part of this and what is not part of this. You know what I mean? So very important to check. There's even been times that I've seen some crazy stuff. For example, like the property line was right down the middle of a house and half of the the property line sorry half of the house was going to the tax sale and the other half was not so that's just some weird stuff better not to mess with that if you know what i mean anyways we're just out here making it happen we got the old little ford focus st there ripping through the city and our undisclosed location. So we got one more house to see, and uh, then it's off to hit it in the title and get the max bid sheet. 